This weekend, we decided to clean up the property and do some landscaping. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I look horrible. I'm okay with that. So we started to clean up, put some stones in place. There's tons of stuff all over the place. This has got it all got cleaned up. Dumping buckets of water. Apparently I left a bunch of buckets of water out. As you can see over here, a pile of leaves, some stones. I want to put all these along here, like clean up this whole area. And then there's a bunch of stones at the back there. So I'm going to bring this forward. Eventually I want to kind of put soil and stuff down and have some plants of some sort. Something that's easily, you know, manageable. Those are all the stones I collected from last year. I think at the end from the stuff from the front that it wore me out so bad that I just kind of left everything in place. And now I get to reap the rewards of not winterizing everything. So that's what I'm going to do. Spend the day doing this stuff. And I'll catch you guys a whole lot later. This is as far as I got with the stacking of the stones, cleaning everything up, and kind of grading everything. That's what remains. A ton of work. Um, got rid of all the nonsense in the corner. That's going to go out front. And if you look over here, amongst all the rest of my nonsense, that's all the garbage I found. That's more garbage. So I restacked the stones over here. Restacked these guys, still cleaning up the brush. That's the rest of the stuff I have to go through. And then now we have a nice clear area back here. Some brush to clean up. I'm going to leave it like this. Got to fix the hole in the fence so Quinn does not escape. That's Quinn. Yeah, you're not escaping. You're not allowed. You're cute. Plus my neighbors know you. They'll bring you back. But yeah, so this is the mission for today. I will not get it done today. It's going to rain tomorrow. So me with my bad hair is going to continue on. Get this stuff all together. But it's starting to look good. Kind of happy with that. Future plans for that shed is I want to uh, build, put a cement pad underneath it. As you can see, these stones are starting to run away and the wood frame that was there is no longer viable. So that's what it is. But yeah, I'm gonna get back to work and get going this way. Quinn found a bit, soccer ball. It is not mine. I don't play soccer. I'm a dirt bike rider. At least I was once. And now we can start grading some dirt back here. Just kind of butt up against here. And that's all we're gonna do. Cause it's a kind of a, a valley, kind of like one of these. So, yeah. All nice and clean, gonna keep it that way. Three high, mom and I talked, that's what she wants. So we have all these nice and neatly stacked. And then we have all those I had buried. So we're gonna continue it this way, three high. Lots of work back is already sore. Well here, as you can see over here, I unburied it. So I still gotta fill all that stuff back in. That's all the dirt from the removal. That's all the stones I took out of the, the ground over there. And those, I have no idea what I'm gonna do with yet. But a little bit of landscaping, lots of fun, lots of work. This will get you into shape. Voila. All this dirt has been moved. We have a nice little flower bed going on. Originally I wanted a greenhouse. That's the leftover stone. I do have ideas for this. I might make a fire pit out of it and or I might just store it in a corner somewhere. Definitely thinking about a fire pit. 
I probably used about half of it. So the other half would go into a corner. Um, speaking of that, I'm gonna make a pathway here. This is gonna have a concrete wall on that side of it and then a concrete wall on that side of it so it doesn't wash away as you see what's happening there. And then I'm gonna pack this up against the concrete wall and there'll be like flowers and stuff and everything kind of sloped down in this. And over here, what might be for the rest of the stones, I want a pathway. So I want to, next thing I want to do is turn this in here and turn this in here. And then we have the concrete going along this way. I'll cut that branch over there. And that way I can store random things behind the shed. I'm big on storage, as you know. Um, the dirt is moved over here. And this is going to be a filler. This is going to be a retaining wall for over there. Uh, concrete pad going there. We're going to have dual doors. Um, this is garbage. So that's going to be gone. And then we're going to have a concrete pad for the shed. And then I'm going to end it right about here. And then this is where I'm going to throw all my wheelbarrows and stuff. So that is the end of it today. And that's the plan. But going forward, I'm going to level this off and uh, well, seed it. Well, level it, seed it. I'm going to put uh, soil over top. That'll help with the leveling as well. So there'll be two levels. Very windy right now. But this looks freaking amazing. I also went and grabbed the marble table. I want to have a table here, a little sitting area. I might put like a, a forever gazebo up. So if anybody knows of one that's really, 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 really cheap, put it here. If not, I'll wait till next year. And uh, that's it for today. So if you like what I do here, if you don't mind the messy hair and whatnot and a little bit of mud, please like, share, and subscribe. If any questions, comments, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If I forget, just let me know. Um, I do forget a lot. And uh, as always, have fun, be safe. If you have any questions, leave them after me and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.